Uh, listen to this one. A dog breeder held against his will, robbed and then kidnapped during a two-day ordeal. He saved himself with some quick thinking behind the wheel of his car. And correspondent Sloan Glass has the details on how this man got himself out of a potentially deadly situation. Absolutely. When you said quick thinking, I mean, pretty miraculous, Marnie. The Florida man thought he was dealing with three men who just wanted a dog. But it turned out to be so much more sinister. They wanted his money and possibly his life. In the end, it was a traffic stop that saved his life. A Florida man was bragging on social media that his dog breeding business was booming. The cash rolling in. The Martin County Sheriff's Department says these three men saw those posts and broke into his home and breeding business. They then robbed and assaulted him before launching on a two-day crime spree. The suspects moved the dog breeder to multiple locations. When on day two, they forced him to drive somewhere new. It was then he was driving on the highway past a police car. That's when he purposefully started driving erratically swerving across three lanes of traffic. He did it right in front of that officer, which caused him to be pulled over and, you know, could have possibly saved his life. All three suspects and the driver got out of the car. They were allowed to return to the car with a warning, but the driver didn't get back in. It was then he made a hand gesture behind his back, like he was pulling the trigger on a gun. And the deputy got suspicious something was wrong. The driver told him he was in trouble and needed help that he had been kidnapped and that there were weapons in the car. He is in really one of the worst situations you can be in as a victim. And that is in a, in a vehicle where those individuals can take him anywhere they want, where they can do whatever they want with him. And I know he was going to get cash, but what about after that? Guns, knives, drugs, and a lot of money was found in the car. The whole story was investigated and confirmed that it was a brazen kidnapping. The victim did what experts say to do, call attention to the situation, but they also warn about social media safety. I think it's very important to be very discreet on social media in terms of where you live, in terms of anything to do with money, success, cars you drive. I just really believe that in terms of, from a safety aspect and not putting yourself out there as a target, Three men were arrested and charged with kidnapping, carjacking, armed burglary, home invasion, false imprisonment, and witness tampering, Marnie. Wow, smart guy. Scary situation. I think a lot of lessons learned there. Absolutely. All right, Sloan, thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.